Hi everyone, uh, welcome to Research and Analysis. In this video, I am going to discuss about some points regarding the formatting of slides in PowerPoint. So first of all, let's discuss how to add page number to your slides. So just go to the insert option and from insert option, just go to header and footer. Just click it and from here, just click slide number and here are given two uh, options apply apply to all if you want to add page number to a specific slide then just click apply but if you want to add page number to all of your slides then just click apply to all when you click it a page number will be added to all of your slides and it will be shown while you are playing your slides and this is also helpful if you are presenting somewhere and in the end of your presentation your audience want to ask a question regarding a specific slide so they can simply t tell you that just open the slide number four or five or whatever they want to ask about so this is how you can add the page number to your slides and if you want to delete a specific slide just select a specific slide and just click delete so that slide will be deleted and alternatively you can also just right click and from here you can just click the delete slide if you want to change the location of your slide you can simply select anyone and just drag wherever you want to put that slide so this is how you can actually change the location of your slide if you want to change the orientation of your slide for your printing purpose or maybe it's uh, it could be the requirement of the screen where you are presenting just go to design option and from here just click slide size just go to custom slide size and from here you can just change the orientation of your slides for example, we want to change from landscape to portrait. Just click it and OK. Ensure fit. And you know, the orientation has been changed. Now let's discuss about, you know, change the color of your text. First of all, you need to put your cursor on a text and from here, you can just change the color. Here are the options from the theme colors, standard colors, or the any color that you have recently used. For example, we just select the whole text and from here we can change the color of our text. And here is also a very good option. For example, if we have any picture and we want to uh, pick that color to our text, what you need to do is just click it here and from here just click the eyedropper option okay first let's select the text and from here just go to eyedropper option and if you want to use this particular color for our text just click it and you know the color of the text is changed as we have selected if we want to add a blank slide next to this slide just click and press enter so a new slide will appear here and and here you can actually add a text or a picture based on your requirement if you want to copy is uh, want to use the copy of this slide or you know you want to make little amendment and you know just add to next slide what you can do is just copy and from here you can just you can just put put the right click and from here you can just select this option you know a new slide will appear that have the just, just similar to your previous one and to new slide you can make some changes so that can be fit in to your requirements i hope this video will be helpful to have the understanding of formatting options in powerpoint thanks for watching